what's up youtube this is your boy king danny x today i'm gonna show you how to dodge and burn using blendive this is my image i took it like yesterday never mind the other imperfections that are on this picture but anything else i'm just gonna show you how to do dodge and burn using blendive the first thing you have to do is do what duplicate your image two times so it's Control j then Control j then the first one below just name it dodge and then the one on top just name it burn just like that let's and see or they call it mute or whatever it is and come to dodge just double click dodge and then this is your layer style you must come to blending options so first of all you have to change the blend mode on top of here to screen like this never mind if it's overexposed and then you come down here and just adjust this until it gets to the part where you want it to be black something like this and then from here you click alt and split alt and split click alt and select here and just split it will do something like this and then press ok you might prefer it to look like this now let's burn let's do burn let's unhide here and just come here and double click on burn and then you come to blend mode and then you select multiply it will be dark like this when you select multiply you can also select here also multiply and also screen is down here okay since we are on multiply here let's return back to the layer style and then you come below here now you come to this slider you just move it until it gets to the point where you say no this is enough something like this you can adjust it to what you prefer you can adjust it to meet what you prefer so for me this is fine and just select this one and press ctrl and select this one and then press ctrl g to group it and then come to mask layer there just do this and then you go to image and then you go to apply image you don't have to change anything here and just press ok it's gonna look like this this is before and this is after before after before after but also this thing uh, it depends what kind of a picture you're doing if it's a close-up portrait it will work better but if it's an image like this and you don't like the effect being on the trees or on the background or affecting anything else just you want it to affect the skin only the first thing you have to do is what hide this one and press shift ctrl alt e shift ctrl alt e to make a copy of this one and then you bring it up here and then you select mask now we're just gonna copy the skin so we can mask it in there so go to select and then color range and then already mine is select has already selected the skin on sample colors as you can see here you can also come to skin tone but it's gonna select more of that and you have no control here so let's just go to sample colors and then see you can press you can press shift to select shift to select select and then alt to minus minus the selection okay let's just do this then do this then select add 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 you can just also add here also here as you can see it's also affecting the the, the 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 tree on the background and also on the front but it doesn't matter so what you're gonna do now is select this one and then you come to group and then you press ctrl g again you group this group and then you press mask to mask it and then you press alt and select here and just drag it down here now it's affecting the skin only now it's affecting the skin only 
and just part of this tree here and also here so guys this is how you do is it called contouring uh, another word is called contouring when especially when you're dealing with makeups and all those kind of things uh, I, I call it just uh, it's also called dodge and ban when it comes to photography you can also zoom here as you can see here it's being affected something like this you can just paint black to remove or white to apply so I'm just applying here make sure it's selected here not here just paint with white white to add white to add this is gonna be my first tutorial in 2020 we're gonna do more you can place and uh, you can leave your comments and questions below i'm just gonna do more tutorials now but i'm just gonna try to keep them short so thank you guys please subscribe king danny x the photographer please subscribe below and you can check me out on instagram if you want to see more of my work it's on Instagram, which is King Denny X. King Denny X signing out.